Hello everyone, this is a quick tutorial video about how to add images into your mail merge. So if you had different images for individuals or if you had sets of images, so say you had uh, agents and you had a certain logo for those agents. So agents will have a certain logo, managers will have a different logo. Or say you had certain signatures, so you can actually label them with the people's first names and you can use that. So the idea is that I've created a data source. This is my file which has the names and addresses of people in Excel and I created a new field called team logo. Now it could be anything picture, signature, whatever. Now here I need to actually put the physical location of the picture. So what I did is in my pictures folder I added three different pictures bear, fish and penguin. So these will be like my I have three different teams and I want to put these images on those letters. So I right click on the bear or any one of them and I go to properties. Okay. Uh, I think I'll have to do it properly. I'll be there. And then go to properties is the last option there. And this is the location of my I'll highlight and I copy it. I'll just cancel this. Come to Word and I'm going to paste it and I'm going to put a slash and I'm going to type bear dot jpg. So this is the actual location of that image bear. Now for the fish instead of bear it should be fish and the penguin dot jpg. And the other thing you have to do is for mail merge to work you have to add an extra slash after each and every one of these slashes. So you make sure you put it after each and every one of them. I'm going to highlight it and copy and I'm going to come to Excel and I'm going to paste it here. I'm going to paste it here. Just for this bear, say this person was part of fish, I can change it to fish. I'll paste it again and I'll change this one to penguin. Now make sure you type the right spelling. If it's uppercase, I would do that. And say this one, the last to me, is part of bear. So I can save it and I'm just gonna close Excel and I'm gonna delete this because I don't need it now I'm gonna start with my mail merge but before I do that I wanna save this now when you save it you wanna save it as a office 2003 format the new 2007 2010 format I've been told as I did my research that it doesn't work so I'm gonna click on file and save in 2007 you'll be looking for the office button the round button here or you just hit the save button here on the top the floppy drive and I'm gonna save this and the save as type I'm gonna choose 97 2003 and for the file name I'll just call it picture mail merge just for now and save it now I'm gonna start my mail merge mailings start step by step and letters that's what I'm doing now I'll hit next where is my starting document this is my starting document I'll click next and I'm gonna browse to where my file is so here's my file the picture mail merge in which I type my name I double click on it sheet one has that information and here is the names and including the locations of the logos. I click OK. Now the next step is write your letter. I'll add a address block. Click OK. Hit enter and then whatever you want it. Say I want the greeting line. No, you know, name. Click OK. Now here I want to add my picture. Say for example, or you need to put it wherever you want. So what you have to do is press Alt and F9 on your keyboard and you'll get this weird looking thing that's okay ignore it we don't care what it means now here I need to type something which will tell it to add the picture so what you do is you hold the control key down on the keyboard press and hold it and then press the plus sign two times one two and also press F9 and now you see you have those two curly brackets now you cannot type it on your keyboard for whatever reason you have to do it this way hold the control button press the plus sign two times and then hit F9 now here I'm gonna type everything uppercase include picture 
I'm going to put a space and I'm going to put a quotation. Now here I want to insert the merge field team logo. So I can just click here on the top and team logo or you can go through more items on the right hand side. So it adds there. Now I'm going to put a quotation to close it. Put a space. I'm going to put a slash and a star, the asterisk symbol, and I'm going to type merge format slash D. So this is the way you have to type this exactly as it is. Now I'm going to press Alt F9 again, so I switch back to where I started. Now you will not see the picture here, that's fine. I'm going to click Next, preview your letter. Next step is complete the merge and I'm going to hit edit individual letters. You will still not see the picture. That's OK. Edit and I'm going to click OK. Here's all my letters. I should have four letters as I type the four names. The pictures are not there yet. That's still OK. I'm hoping it works as I do this step. Now you have to press Control A to highlight all your documents. So now if you had thousands of records, the step may take a little time and you have to press F9 to refresh. Now there it is. So the first one is a bear. Let's see. Second one is a fish. Third one is a penguin. And the fourth one, that's my name, should be a bear. So there it is. So it's just a little tricky. So again, I'll just show you here. Alt F9. So this part, you just need to be careful and type it exactly the way I've typed it no spelling mistakes and this should work for you hope this helps uh, I had a question from somebody hope this will help them thank you for watching